another thing that's happened in the culture, uh, and I think I'm a typical example of this too, is spiritual hunger. Uh, I teach at secular schools and my students are hungry. They want a moral vocabulary. They want to understand some ultimate end in life. They want to understand what grace is. They want to understand what redemption is. They're haunted by senses of shame and sin. And so they are aware we live in a moral universe. Uh, and yet they don't, sometimes are not given, not, it's not their fault, they're not given a vocabulary to, to understand these moral sensations they have. And when I look at either the Jewish world or the Christian world or the Muslim world, I see um, moral richness and spiritual richness. And I see communities that have what the culture wants. Mm 